Hi everyone so today i have an amazing video and in this workflow you can take any image as you can see and convert it into anime style artworks now it will not only follow the pose it will also like uh, understand the outfit the colors the vibe everything and the best part is it will try to extract the facial features and then create the particular anime style uh, image so you can see as the eyes are blue so it has been replicated here and some of the face shape will be re replicated this does not recreate the faces again and it uh, creates that like cartoonish or like digital illustration anime style artworks but it tries to take those features and then create it so you are not copying anyone's face but uh, you are still getting some of the facial features and not only that i have many different examples and i'll show the all of them in some time now remember one thing we are using uh, two things we are using the redux and we are using pulid right so you if you have not installed pulid before because it can be a little bit tricky i already have a complete video on pulid you can see this one consistent face and i'll provide the link in the description so you can check that video out as well now one thing i would like to give a disclaimer that i was facing some kind of issue with pulid for uh, like last 15 20 days there was an error and how i solved it i'll also show in this video so basically what i did was you can go to the manager and in pulid you can see i have the pulid comfy ui i also installed a comfy ui pulid flux enhanced one so this is the one that uh, i actually installed right and then i was going through reddit and i found this particular uh, link so it is a link of a python file and you need to put it in the custom notes comfy ui pulid flux enhanced but i did not put it in the flux enhanced i also put it in the normal comfy ui pulid so for both the custom notes i have put this particular file you can see this is the file again the link will in the description below so uh, you don't need to worry about that you can find it in the description box so just download it and uh, put it in uh, both of the folders if you are having uh, any error if you are not having any kind of error you don't need to do anything right and other than that i also have videos on redux as well i'll link them but uh, it's uh, i think that part is pretty easy now we are using two loras right and you can see this is the first lora then we are using the depth lora then we are using another lora and this is the one that uh, actually has that uh, cartoony anime style vibe okay the second lora uh, is this one that is velvet's uh, mythic fantasy styles so when you combine both of these you get a pretty good result so these are the two uh, loras here as well right and other than that you can see that uh, this particular has the strength of 0.6 you can slightly play with it and the gothic one has 0.4 because the, we do not want to be in that style but sometimes it adds like pretty good results when it comes to eyes and other subtle details so that's it other than that i don't think you would be uh, needing to change anything but you can again play with the um, style model and uh, you can also like uh, try to increase or decrease the depth lora if you do not want like exact uh, replica of it so maybe you want pose and uh, you want a little bit of leniency like you want to keep the outfit and the whole vibe but uh, you want to change the pose a little bit so you can try to reduce the uh, strength model of depth lora as well other than that it is using the ggua versions so it is uh, it would be okay for low vram uh, users as well that would not be any like difficult thing and after that in the case sampler you are using we are using the sampler name days and scheduler beta so with that you can create these images so i'll show some of the examples now and here you can see 
So basically, if you look at the faces here, right, you can see that some of not only the expression, some of the styles like uh, this may not be exactly green, but it has like greenish tint in her eyes and the Pule try to replicate it. So the eyes are green and you can also see it uh, copies the face pretty well. So uh, the shape. So the basic shape has been copied and uh, uh, other than that it copies the elements so there is this chain there is this bracelet and everything and you can see like uh, it is not the exact color but it understands what is the background so according to that it has created this and it looks pretty good sometimes you may find now one thing that you would see is that i am using the width and height of 1280 now you can change that and you can go up to like uh, you can check and you can go up to uh, I think 1400 by 1400. So that is the max I have got uh, gotten good results. But now here you can see that this is basically doing like uh, this is keeping the proportion. So uh, you need to check the total megapixels. Remember that and uh, other than that i think if you are going the longer side uh, 1400 would be okay so we are talking about because these are portrait images if you are uh, fixing the height for around 1400 pixels so it would automatically take the width and it would be okay so you can try a little bit higher resolution to fix if you have slight problems with fingers or something like that but other than that it looks pretty good now second one you can see and this is the reason I have taken like uh, images of uh, different ethnicity or different skin color. I wanted to see how it replicates and again you can see uh, the eye color is brown. So here you can see the eye color is brown. So that is the thing which you would not get directly if you just use redux or just use depth. So that is why we are using the pulid and uh, it understands like the teeth and uh, overall pose it can understand pretty well it understood the rings as well the face shape you can see the chin yeah so that is the thing and uh, it gets a pretty good idea of the outfit in the background you can see it seems like clouds or something like that and it tried uh, to replicate it flux so uh, again pretty good not bad and even uh, because the fingers here were slightly uh, like complex it could not create that here again if you increase the resolution it would be pretty okay now third one is obviously this one and you can see sometimes like uh, it changes the outfit a little bit but it gets the total idea so it has changed the shoulders but other than that it gets a pretty good idea you can see how the eyes have been replicated like uh, the eye color and uh, you would have seen in anime like uh, basically anime is based on cats the characters uh, in anime are based on cats uh, to make them look cuter that is the reason so uh, that's why they have like slightly enlarged eyes and everything but uh, the actual features like the eye color the lip color uh, somewhat of the uh, face you can see like slight blush here right and there is the highlight so everything will almost be the same so this was like uh, the whole workflow and let me know if you have any kind of problem or doubt now remember one thing again like if you are having the pulid uh, problem uh, go with this one try to download this python file and put it in both uh, the enhanced pulid and the normal config ui pulid both the folders and it should fix it because i was facing the same problem and it fixed it so that's it you'll get all the links in the description below and you can also check out my uh, video on how to install pulid and like the whole uh, pulid workflow and that's it so if you have any kind of doubts or problems just uh, put it in the comment section below and i'll try to reply as soon as possible thank you